I was activated on the first day of Chinese New Year last year. My husband told me that there's a message for you to immediately come and report to work to assist in the hospital's isolation ward. My mom was with me at that time. Um, she cried because uh, at that time, um, COVID-19 is a new virus and we really don't know what we'll expect. Initially, when the science wasn't very clear, we were trying to figure out the policies on the fly. We will present our flowchart for patients. In other words, when you have patients with fever, with swab positive, what do you do? And almost every week, I have to present a different chart because it was always changing. Uh, there was um, a lot of patients from uh, S11 at Pongo, one of the dormitories that houses uh, as many as 13,000 uh, dormitory residents. At the start, there was about a team of three to four doctors and nurses per day uh, going down and the patient load can be as high as um, uh, 60s, even 100s uh, at times when it's busy and, and it was quite overwhelming for all of us involved. We got word about the S11 uh, together with uh, another dormitory uh, in the west being gazetted and then Singh Health was kind of asked to come to the table at the JTF meeting the next day, in fact, on the 12th of April, we had to launch the first uh, massive swap operation. When we heard the news about uh, circuit breaker, our first concern is really the elders. Routine disrupted has very great impact, especially for elders with dementia. For example, like even eating, even having mm. their meals. Some of them just refuse to have their yeah. meals or even have their daily hygiene, like bathing, disrupted because suddenly they lost track of that routine. Healthcare provision in the nursing homes was actually very restricted, very strict guidelines on who can go in and who cannot. And for residents who maybe at the end of their life, they had little access to home hospice teams, they had little access to even their own loved ones. When we first started, the CTF is really very new to us. The skill, I would say that is unprecedented, we had to work with a lot of uh, partners. So the, the initial challenge was really uh, 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 the unknown unknowns because you're not more with each other. And my first thought was this is joining a national effort in a battle against COVID-19. The existence of uh, community care facilities allowed us to bring the battle to the front line. Instead of fighting the battle, within the precious resource of a hospital. Everyone asked me whether I was fearful. The answer is no. This is my responsibility. As being a nurse, uh, we always have to expect the unexpected. Before I leave the house, my 10-year-old son gave me a big hug. He told me that I can do it and to take good care. <laughs>